Hello, vlog family. making a hot cocoa. I was inspired to make this. Oh, that's not even a hot cocoa. That's a hot cocoa. There we go. I was inspired to make this, if you will, because this morning Dan and I made, and by Dan and I, I mean Dan, made pancakes for breakfast. And he wanted to do something a little more special than just traditional pancakes. So in the batter, he mixed in a little bit of cocoa powder to make them like chocolate pancakes. And then he added chocolate chips on top. And then he made the whipped cream from scratch, which is something we do kind of often, but he added, instead of adding vanilla extract to the whipped cream, he added mint extract. And it is the most glorious whipped cream I have ever eaten in my life. He said he was just a one for one uh, switch that he did. So this full amount of vanilla that it calls for, he did the full amount of mint. If we do it again, we'll probably cut that down by like a quarter. We'll take like a quarter off of that. It was so good. So you were eating like mint chocolate chip pancakes. Oh, it's fantastic. But we have leftover whipped cream. So I'm going to put some of my, some of this mint whipped cream on top of my hot cocoa because I typically put mint extract in my hot cocos anyway. So I'm gonna add the whipped cream on top of it, and then I'm gonna do a few Christmas sprinkles. I think I'm gonna do these red, green, and white jimmies. And that's what it looks like. It's so cute. And the whipped cream is fantastic. Um, nom, nom, nom. Ah, I left for two seconds to let the dog in the house and it's overflowing. But it looks great. joining me outside now. I decided after loving on Mr. Lambo here for a few minutes that his face is far too fluffy. There's not a battery in that. So I'm going to shave his face. Now you're probably not going to be able to see hardly anything, but that's okay. I'll show you a before and after. Now for those of you who don't know, because there are a lot of you that are new to this channel in the last like year and a half, so for those of you who don't know, I, I was a dog groomer for several years. So when I say I'm shaving his face, I'm not just like trying to do a home haircut. I mean, in the technical sense, yes, I am doing a home haircut because I'm giving him a slight haircut and I'm at home, but I also have the experience that I know what I'm doing. So I'm not, but like, don't do this at home unless you have experience. <laughs> And also don't do it outside where there's tons of distractions unless you have the reflexes. So Lambo, come here. Let me see your face. Let me see your face. Look at how fuzzy that face is. Sit up, up, up. No, 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 no. Come on. Up, 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 up. Good boy. All right. Here's kind of a... Oh, if so I can I'll flip your other ear back. Okay. Look at me, Lambo. Here's kind of an after and still a before. So we got a half and half happening on his face right now. <laughs> All right, and here is the after. Look at that beautiful naked face. Look at that. Oh, it's such a good boy. Such a good boy. Okay, you can go play. You can go play. I need to clean off my pants. There you go. I'm gonna go get you a treat. <laughs> now you're joining me in our garage. Why? Because I wanna shave his feet now too. Look at that beautiful naked foot. Is it perfect? Absolutely not. But this is only, I think, like his second time getting a shaved foot. I see some hairs hanging out right there. But look at that compared to that. 
before and after. Oh, that's satisfying to see. Now just three more to go. Are you up for it? Lambo, look how good you look. That was such a good boy. Yeah. Oh, that was such a good boy. No, no, gentle with the cat. Gentle with the cat. He's still healing. Oh, he's such a good boy, Lambo. Yeah. Look at how fresh and crisp you look. Yeah. So does that one, two, three, four, seven, ten. Oh, the back actually showed what all of them were. So this is gonna be the last two days. Oh, I mean, this is like a really sad attempt at that snowman, but like that that's still really cool. So it looks like I'm getting Santa tomorrow and a snowflake the last day, but that's that's cool. Hello, good morning. It is Tuesday morning. I am in the car going for a little road trip with a certain puppy because we are going into Fort Wayne to give him a bath. He desperately needs a bath and I have been hunting for places that I can do a self-serve dog wash because I have a tub. I can wash him at home if I really, really wanted to, but in order to get his hair nice and straight and looking good, I, I need the good high velocity dryers, which I do not own. And they are, if you want a good one, they're a couple hundred bucks. So I need to find somewhere where I can use one for cheap. So I was looking around, there's absolutely nothing in Columbia City where we are. Um, and Warsaw, which is about 20, 30 minutes uh, west, there is nothing. So Fort Wayne is my only option, which it's about a half an hour. Then I have a lot of options. So I found a Pet Supplies Plus that has a self-serve dog wash. And I called them yesterday to confirm that they had it. And the guy that answered the phone, he was like, yep, yep. He's like, it's just, it's 10 bucks a bath. Um, or you can buy a card that's like $25, but it's good for five baths. And I'm like, well, obviously I'm gonna be that one. So, and he said that it's just first come, first serve. So it is currently just after 8.30 because the Pet Supplies Plus store opens at nine. So Mr. Lambo, Pup, and I are on our way there. Lambo, look how fluffy you are. My goodness, look how fluffy the puppy is. Lambo, look at how fluffy you are, puppy. Let me see your face. Look at that handsome face. Oh, such a fluffy puppy. Look at that fluffy puppy. His tail and ears are still just a little tiny bit damp, but it got to the point I was like, you know what? He's, he's good. The rest of him is dry. I am happy with it. Look at how fluffy and clean you are. Goodness, look at you. Mm -hmm. It looks like you... Well, maybe he didn't have a wonderful time and he was just happy to be home. I don't know. I think he's happy to be home, but he didn't have a bad time. Look at how fluffy and soft. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Dan called his clean feet with the fuzzy legs the bell bottoms. <laughs> well, hi, kitten. Do you smell all the smells? You're so clean and cute. Oh, my goodness. 